Hello, this is film critic Murtaza Ali Khan. Today we have with us the star cast, you know, who have come specially from Mumbai to Delhi and uh, Donu. Uh, also, we have with us Sura sir and we have the wonderful young director Avnish. Uh, welcome uh, to this special segment. Uh, Sura sir, usually I would have started with you, but today yes, uh, Avnish yeah. being the captain <laughs> of the ship, I must start with you. Thora sir, batayye, you know, how did this project come together? Like, what is the creative vision behind it? Uh, in, in 2018, we started working on this subject. Uh, the idea of, uh, you know, a, a, the, the basic story is of a, a young man, Dave, played by Rajveer, who goes to the wedding of his best friend, who is Dulhan. But he loves her secretly. He doesn't know Dulhan, ko pata nahi, but he's been in love with her for 10 years. So this story you have probably listened to. But he doesn't want to marry the wedding. वो जाता है looking for closure क्योंकि वो ज़िंदगी में move on करना चाहता है so that was one element which I felt that मैंने एक फिल्मों में देखा नहीं था और I feel कि आज के generation में moving on की जो importance है वो ज़्यादा discuss होती है उसकी अहमियत कितनी ज़्यादा है हमें आज समझ में आ रही है हमने पहले फिल्मों में देखा हुआ है कि एक तरफा प्यार हमने देखा हुआ है या फिर देवदास की तर प्यार ना कामयाब रहा तो फिर किस तरह गम एक आदमी को डुबा सकता डुबा सकता है तो I think ये एक अलग एक नजरिया है on unrequited love and I really hope that people like this film because it really inspired us to make this film. There is a soul to the film for sure. I've seen the trailer and I can and there is this Rajshree stamp also. So want to come to you, Sura sir. इस तरह के प्रोजेक्ट में यू नो जब इतना इंटरेस्टिंग एलिमेंट रहता है लव का और राजश्री यू नो मुझे तो ब्रांड एम्बेसडर्स लगते हैं लव की यू नो फॉर द लास्ट मेनी डिकेड्स हाउ डू यू सी दिस पर्टिकुलरली नाउ दैट यू हैव नॉट डायरेक्टेड इट बट यू आर स्टिल अ वेरी इंटीमेट पार्ट ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट हाउ डू यू सी दिस फिल्म दोनों आई एम वेरी वेरी क्यूरियस एंड वेरी हैप्पी टू सी द आउटकम बिकॉज एक डिफरेंट टेक है हमारे लिए मेरे लिए क्योंकि जब जैसे अवनीश ने कहा कि जब उसने ये कहानी सोची तो एक लड़का दस साल से किसी को चाहता है और उसकी शादी में जाना चाहता है क्लोजर के लिए एक लड़की जो पलोमा प्ले कर रही है मेघना का कैरेक्टर छः साल से एक रिलेशनशिप में रही है और वो ब्रेकअप हुआ है और वो उसी से मिलेगी तो ये पूरे चीज़ें यार इतने लेयर्ड हैं इतने कॉम्प्लेक्स हैं फिर भी इतने इतने सेंसिटिव हैं तो जब जब मैं जब मेरे से डिस्कस करता था अवनीश मुझे बहुत खुशी होती थी कि ये ये मेरे किरदारों से जुदा हैं क्योंकि जो मेरी फिल्म है उसमें हमेशा सिंपल सॉफ्टनेस सटल्टीज कोई धोखा नहीं कोई दगा नहीं कोई दिल टूटा नहीं बट ये सब थोड़े से टूटे हैं थोड़े से बिखरे हैं लेकिन रियल हैं तो जब मैं तीनों को काम करते हुए देखता था तो मुझे एहसास हुआ कि ये तीनों राष्ट्रीय को एक एक नई सुबह दिखा रहे हैं एक नई रोशनी दिखा रहे हैं तो एक बहुत आ, आ, खुशी हुई कि मेरे बाद अब ये थोड़ा सा स्टेप आगे है राष्ट्रीय के लिए और दोनों बहुत खूबसूरत फिल्में फ्लैश ब्लूमिंग फ्लावर्स की तरह है तो मुझे लगता है ऑडियंस को बहुत पसंद है आई थिंक द होल ऑफ कंट्री द होल ऑफ सिनेमा लवर्स यू नो वी आर रियली ईगरली लुकिंग फॉरवर्ड टू दिस वन And uh, Rajshree, it's stem to just say, I have said that I am here and you are here. I think that really speaks volumes that you are very much invested in this project. Uh, Rajveer and uh, Paloma, you know, I want to know about the chemistry of you. On the camera, pe toh dikh raha hai, you know, I see a lot of, you know, spark. But what kind of off-screen, like the kind of off-screen conversation you had, you know, which helped you evolve this chemistry, what was it like behind the camera? I think the first few conversations hmm. we had was about dogs. <laughs> she loves dogs, I love dogs. <laughs> so we just kept talking about dogs. I remember when we were auditioning together in the break room. <laughs> so that helped break the ice. <laughs> yeah. It was very easy yeah. to talk to him actually. So And he was someone that I think we fed off each other in our scripts or in our, while we worked together as well. I, I felt like he's a very giving actor as well. It was very easy and comfortable to work with him. Yeah. But uh, what was your question again? About the chemistry of screen conversations that you used to have, you know. Yeah, also the way our characters are written now, it's written in so much detail and it's written so real that it, it comes, it, our director, you know, I think we'd give credit to our director. Any specific brief that Avnish gave you for your characters? So, Particularly, I want you to, you know, like any, any insights? 
So Meghna has a lot of layers to herself. So Avnish wanted to make her as real as, as a human as possible. So I was able to tap into a lot of different emotions and, and show all sides of a human being as well. And Meghna has her own journey and her own story. So that for, the, for that, you'll have to watch the film. <laughs> we all are, the whole country is looking forward to it. Rajveer, I've heard you talk about, you know, world cinema. There are so many stars in your own family, but of course you are also introduced to world cinema. So if any specific role models come to you, you know, outside of your family, I know you, your family itself yes, has yes, so many role yes, models yes. for you, but any role models outside of your, your family? Uh, there's so many. I listen to a lot of rap music. I play a lot of video games, video game developers like Hido Kojima. Rap music like obviously Kendrick Lamar, MF Doom, to basketballer Kobe Bryant, LeBron James, Derrick Rose, to world cinema, uh, I mean there's so many. Uh, you got, recently I saw this movie called After Sun, I loved it. Uh, you have Irfan Khan who I grew up watching and I really, really was watching him for my movie also. Wow. Quite a bit. Uh, just, I just suck at my naming lists, so I'm just going on top of my head. <laughs> There's just so many. You have your Scorsese's, you got your Kubrick's, you got your Lance von Tayor, you got like, you got so many. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. and, and the beauty of it is that you also have one legend sitting I next mean, to you. That's, that's, that's <laughs> <a given. laughs> Avnish, lastly, you know, like what were your reference points for this? I know that the story, of the, because of the closure, not has many reference points in that sense. But otherwise, pure ki pure construct ko dekha jai, so which were the reference point for you while making this film? Uh, in terms of movies and directors? Yes, yes. Uh, so, obviously, a film that I have seen a lot, which is based on marriage, is Who Is Your Father? That was one film that I have seen a lot. Besides, there were many other films that I have seen a lot, which I have seen a lot, which I have seen just to keep that inspiration. One film which I have seen a lot, which I was a teenager, which I बहुत पसंद आई एंड विच हैड द सेम काइंड ऑफ इनोसेंस आई वांटेड वाज अ फिल्म कॉल्ड जाने तू या जाने ना डायरेक्टेड बाय बास टायर वाला दैट वाज अ फिल्म जो मैं बार बार देखता था क्योंकि उसमें जो एक इनोसेंस है उस इस उम्र की आई रियली वांटेड टू कैप्चर दैट इस वेल उसके अलावा एक और फिल्म थी फॉर वेडिंग्स एंड फ्यूनरल माइक न्यूवल की यस 94 में ह्यू ग्रांट जिससे इतने बड़े स्टार बने सो दैट वाज अनदर फिल्म जो मुझे लगता है कि शादी की जो अलग-अलग एस्पेक्ट्स हैं अलग-अलग जो किरदार हैं किस तरह शादी में आके सारे किरदार जैसे जुड़ जाते हैं उस फिल्म में बहुत बखूबी से दिखाया है तो ये दो फिल्में थी जो मैं बार-बार देखता था Sir, sir, Avnish, Rajveer, Paloma, I wish you all the best and thank you so much. Uh, so this was a very special segment for you and the film is releasing on October 5. So please do watch it in your nearest cinema halls. Thank, thank you, you so much. much. Thank you so much. Sir.